We are a brand that builds things for creators, with creators. What we do is we solve big problems, come up with good ideas, and try and make an impact. I think that design is understood in a completely new way. I think we're growing up with a generation that design is at the forefront and the baseline of everything that we see. Every designer is always really excited and keen on having how to showcase, how to promote, how to how would my product look the best. Every project is a house on fire. Design is constantly having to keep up with technology. To be limited by technology is our absolute worst nightmare. As the future of where things are going, the need for 3D is gonna increase exponentially. 3D can feel really scary for designers. Oh God, how are we gonna be able to use that? Well, I'm good at this. I don't know if I'm good at that. It's a new tool and it's a pretty gnarly learning curve. The photo world and design world are blending in this way because the design is becoming more photographic. The photo world, there's this trend to be more graphic in the compositions. So 3D is like the sweet spot in the middle. One thing that I see that would be really beneficial is just roughing out ideas for product photography. The idea to get a sense for what your photo shoot's gonna look like and feel like is really helpful because it saves you money and it saves you time. Obviously, as you plan shoots, for example, with athletes, you start to look at a major logistic confluence of factors like having samples, having the athlete, having the place, and all coming together at the right point in time. And we have only barely scratched the surface of what one can do by avoiding that whole hassle and bringing bringing in together things virtually. We're in this massive transition period of where we're about to hit. It breaks the chains off of limiting us on ideas and really opens that space to really ideate about anything. <laughs>